I'm going to be sharing with you some important dates that you need to keep in mind. Exam opening entry date. The standard exam entry deadline. Late exam entry deadline. <laughs> everyone planning to give your ACC exams this June attempt well then make sure you watch this video till the end so I'm going to be sharing with you some important dates that you need to keep in mind if you're planning to give your exams in June so your exam opening entry date that means from that date onwards you could book your exam was 7th February 2023 from from that day onwards you can book your exam for your June attempt now your standard exam entry deadline is 1st May 2023. So make sure you're booking your exams by this date. All right, do not wait too long. And your late exam entry deadline is 8th May 2023. After that, you will not be able to book for your June attempt. And of course, for your late exam entry, you will have to pay a late fee. So that's why it's very important you meet this standard exam entry deadline itself, which is 1st May, right? So book your exams for first May. And I have some great news for you. Fintram Global, who's the gold approved ACC learning partner, is coming up with various live orientation sessions and live demo classes for all you ACCA students. Yes, this is happening for June 23 batch. So if you're planning, if you want to give any, for any particular subject, you're thinking that, oh, I will be appearing in the June attempt, then make sure you attempt the live orientation session. It is absolutely free. So don't worry about that. All you have to do, just register. Two minutes also it will not take. Simply register, attend the session, you know, get a whole picture about it. And you know, there are some students who will be thinking, why so early? June exam is not literally coming. We have some time. Yes, we do have some time, but it's always beneficial to start early. If you start from now, if you start taking the orientation and then you decide, okay, this is what I want to do from there. I want to study. You can go online, buy the course, and then you can just start your preparation. If you start right away from, you know, this period onwards, March end, then by the time you reach May end, you will be comfortably done with all your sessions, everything. And you'll be very, you know, confident for your June attempt. However, if you start late, let's say if you start by mid-April or end April, then by May end, it's going to be a little chaotic. You're going to be everywhere. You will be very tense for your June attempt because you probably would have not even completed your syllabus. So that's why it's always beneficial to start early. Yes. So attempt these free orientations, free demo sessions that we are having. These are online sessions on Zoom. So make sure you attempt them. Just have to register for it. Attend these sessions and then take a decision, okay, which subject I want to give or if you have already thought, okay, this subject, so attend for that subject, the orientation. And then, of course, definitely book your exam before these deadlines and do not miss on these deadlines these dates are very important so keep them in mind maybe on your mobile phone keep a reminder that you know maybe just a week before may keep it as a reminder that i have to book for my exam uh, or maybe if you are fully sure that okay this is the paper i want to give you can start from now on because like i said from 7 february onwards this is open you can book for your june attempt so don't waste any more time because what happens in the end we are busy in preparation and we forget to book and then i'm sure you don't want to pay that late entry fees right so make sure you are keeping this in mind and as soon as possible booking all right all the very best this is disha johan signing off